Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I will be showing you my mini envelopes. People who follow me on Instagram might have seen them already. Um, and I have promised to make a video and show you uh, step by step how I make these envelopes. And also I will be decorating them as well. Um, for the construction part of these envelopes, I use um, these parchment large baking cups. These are the ones that I'm using. Yeah. Um, also, for the decoration, I uh, will be using today a beautiful digitals uh, from a digital gouache club uh, shop it's an online uh, beautiful shop um, I will put the link uh, in the description box down below uh, of the online shop and also um, the names of the kids that I'm using in this video so these are the ones that we will be using today These beautiful postcards, these ones, and these are vintage Christmas postcards. Um, I have chosen this for today's video, but you can go and check it out and uh, choose whatever you like. Uh, the online shop is beautiful. It is uh, so well organized. Um, you can find there a huge variety of um, uh, collections, digital kits, uh, postcards, ATC cards, circle, square cards, like a lot, a lot of uh, stuff that you can use in your journals, your projects. Um, there is something for any occasion, for weddings, uh, for Christmas, Halloween, um, Valentine's Day, Easter, um, yeah, for absolutely everything. And I'm sure there is something for every taste. Um, there is a huge variety of uh, vintage Christmas uh, kits. Uh, also, you can choose from... Um, lot of also you can choose from a wide range of uh, Halloween digitals and uh, so many other uh, beautiful kits um, the shop is massive I'm sure you'll find anything you look for um, also why I like this shop so much is because it offers not only gorgeous digital kits, but also uh, a lot of videos from other crafters who uh, show uh, their projects and their tutorials. So um, when you go to this website, you not only purchase uh, a digital kit, but you also can find a lot of inspiration using this uh, digital kit so I'm sure you like uh, this online shop uh, so please go and check it out I'll leave all the information down below and now let's go and start um, the uh, making these beautiful envelopes they're mini mini envelopes that you can use um, in every journal uh, you can make uh, these mini envelopes for any uh, team journal for christmas for halloween um, for valentine's day like it depends on the way how you decorate them also um, there is another way you can uh, glue down a paper clip on the back side um, of the envelope and just use it as a paper clip on a page of your journal and in this way I'm sure uh, it will make your journal page even more beautiful. Um, also, uh, 
uh, you can just add it to a pocket in your journal. Uh, you can um, glue down this side and the bottom and just uh, make a pocket or a tuck spot out of it. So um, I think uh, there's so many options using these mini envelopes. Uh, so they're very practical, they're very simple to make, a lot of fun, and like the decoration part is the best. Um, so um, these are another type of uh, kind of an envelope where I just didn't make the flap. I left it open. Uh, I think it looks beautiful in this way so I haven't decorated the back side of this uh, because I wanted to use them as a pocket in my journal but you can decorate the back side as well so I'll show you first this that I have already made These are the stuff that I just added inside. Okay, and then these ones. These uh, postcards, they're from Digital Quash Club Shop as well. They're so beautiful, I love the colors. this one as well so there we go when you open it there is a lot of space you can add even more stuff than these two so they provide more space to collect stuff or to put uh, something like for extra journaling yeah like this is my favorite when you open it so I glue down this Tim Holtz paper clip and just edit this there you go spot Oops. yeah just extra space for journaling
and the last one. Let's start first with uh, these uh, mini envelopes. Uh, there, uh, first, uh, to make these mini envelopes, you don't need a lot of stuff. You just need the parchment baking cups, any size you like, uh, extra large, large. If you like even uh, smaller than this, you can use a smaller size of baking cups. Um, uh, I mean, uh, when I make these envelopes, I don't measure. Uh, the only thing I use is glue. So let's uh, start. So this is the baking cup. What I do, I just press it, open it like this, and now I fold. the bottom so this is um, when you work with uh, parchment it's noisy so I apologize for the noise um, also it is a little bit uh, hard to work with parchment uh, but these are very easy to make so when you fold so you first fold this way then you need to, then you open it and you make two folds from both sides here, oh, a little bit small, there we go. Okay, now you have this one, now you fold it, go. and this is your flap of the envelope. go a mini envelope now let's glue it down so you open it and you need to apply glue here on these uh, small flaps on both sides You need to leave it uh, for a few minutes just to get dry because, yeah, it's parchment and it takes more time. So this is the flap and, oh, you need scissors. <laughs> okay, we just need to cut this two small flaps out so these are from the flap of the envelope you just cut them this way Oops. there we go and we do the same with the other one you just follow the lines Oh. 
this is it, it, it needs to get dry I'll leave it to dry but I just want to show you yeah the envelope and it's so beautiful even to leave it like this I think it's cute there we go I have uh, even um, smaller than these ones I have this size so we can make even a smaller envelope let's try using So this is even a smaller size sample so this is the first one and this is the second I mean it is quite smaller than the first one okay these are the two sizes let's make one more of uh, Okay, let's make one more of the smaller ones. Okay, you just fold it this way, then open it, fold it from both sides.
Now I'll show you how to make this um, mini envelopes. So we'll make two sizes of them as well. So using uh, the bigger size uh, baking cup and the smaller size. Let's start with the bigger one. So we we'll just fold them like this. I leave about one inch from the top or I mean you can fold it uh, to make it even smaller pocket so it depends yeah on what you like I like it this way to have a deeper pocket and then when you fold it like so you need to fold it uh, from both sides You don't need to measure anything, you just do it like this. This is the back and this is the front. Now we need to glue down these two small flaps. So we apply glue only here on the bottom side, uh, we don't apply glue here, just on this side. leave it to dry and we'll make a smaller size in the same way so we fold it so when you fold the two sides you do not follow the bottom line you don't go like this, you just go a little upper, so do not fall. I mean, this is how I like it, so you need to have this. And you do the same from the other side. This is your mini mini envelope. So this is the first size, this is the second. I made one more. <laughs> so we have three. So uh, as you can see, these mini envelopes are so easy, so simple to make. Um, and so much fun and now uh, we'll start decorating them all of these uh, we'll decorate in this video uh, but I think I will put a nice music on uh, for the rest of the video so you can enjoy it um, 
I would like to say a huge thank you for watching my videos uh, to all my subscribers who follow my channel I appreciate your support um, I will be so happy to hear your opinions uh, down below uh, and to see um, pictures of uh, your mini envelopes if you decide to make uh, the same ones um, also please subscribe to my channel if you like my work and uh, thanks again for watching and I'll see you very soon. Please enjoy the rest of my video.